So Vic, tell us, how did you uh, how did you prepare the pig? Uh, first of all, it's dead. It's been dead a couple of days. Uh, Ray concentrated his first. Yeah. <laughs> Where's then the pig come from? Then we chomped on its kidney. Yeah, lovely kidney. It had a, a penis two inches long. It was normally six inches. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> the, the pig penis has got curls in it. Yeah, it, it left it's hand, actually, it's, it was yeah, left hand thread, which is faint. Which yeah. normally oh, I see. And Does that mean it, it tastes better? Like yeah. All right. Um, uh, otherwise, what can I say? Uh, but it's cooking. Really it's well. cooking very well, and uh, it's all on cool. Oh, good guy. Oh yes. Now, what I'll do is, when I get the crack, then I'll turn it upside down, and get a leg out. Yeah, of course. What is the sign? Four twenty-one. That's good. Yeah. 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 Pig's jowls is a delicacy, isn't it? Jowls or cheeks? Or is that Cheek, same well, thing? same thing, isn't it? Two without. Have you come close to losing fingers, Ray? When I was younger, yeah. I fed that into a bandsaw around there. Ah. Took the top off of there, chopped that out. <laughs> but I, the older you get, the less the mistakes. Less you do. When you're younger and you got open the business, you want to please everyone and you're trying to do everything. That's the big mistake I must say. Helps if you have a sharp knife, eh? And that's the other thing, you want a sharp knife. If you try and do this with a blunt knife, that's when you cut yourself, really. Promise me, I'm tired. Can you eat the ears just like this? Yeah. Oh yeah, they're nice, crispy ears. Just the big hair, it's really nice. Did I tell you, a friend of mine, chap who lives in Northumberland, bought directly next to a nice church. And living in directory, the fate takes place in his grounds, you see. It's a bit like here. Then, yeah. I said, what happens? He said, well, they do sand, they sell plants. And I said, right, for you to give you a sender, I'll come and do a pig. Hmm. I said, how many people do you do? He said, 50, 60. I said, what do they raise? Well, you know, 100 pounds. I said, don't get me a large pig. Got a 120 pound pig. I've never seen anything like it. In one hour it was gone. All of Northumberland, because what he did, the son of a bitch. He advertised as a celebrity chef cooking the pig. <laughs> How's it going, chef? Been a good day? Very good day. It's amazing how things work. <laughs>